Today, instead of reading you a fairy story, as I usually do, I'm going to tell you a really true Christmas story. Would you like that? Yeah. Does it have a happy ending? Well, it starts out rather sadly, but yes, it does have a happy ending. Good. Once upon a time... <laughs> a long, long time ago, when I was a little girl, just like you, I lived on a farm with my mother and father. And each year, just before Christmas, my father would take me into town to buy a gift for my mother. Then, one year, when I was seven years old, a sad thing happened. And there wasn't any reason to go into town to buy the gift. My mother died, but I didn't cry. I was too angry to cry because she had gone away and left me. My father told me it would be better if I cried because, he said, tears were God's way of melting a heart that was frozen in grief. But I was too angry to cry. And that was when he told me the story of the Christmas dove. Some people call it the dove of peace. Anyway, he said it happened during a terrible, terrible war. And that one evening, even though it was Christmas Eve, there was a battle raging. And suddenly, across the battlefield, a beautiful dove appeared, soaring gracefully and easily. And when the soldiers saw it, their guns went silent, and they remembered that it was the birthday of the Prince of Peace. And then what do you think happened? Those soldiers threw away their guns and they started walking toward each other across the battlefield. And when they reached each other, they embraced and they wept. And their tears melted the anger in their hearts. And then I cried too, because I understood why my father had told me the story of the Christmas dove. I realized that he wanted me to know that there's no peace without forgiveness and no happiness without peace. <laughs>